Well, hey, Poke Species 7 here. Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me today as we jump back into a very dark and wet vintage story. So I went uh, went out exploring yesterday evening to see if I couldn't find us some bees, thinking, hey, I'll be able to do an episode and go, hey, you see that marker on the map? There's a bee's nest there. We're going to get that. No. And what I actually managed to do is get myself stranded in the middle of nowhere in the middle of the night. Yeah. Good job. So, um, I'm going to take that out of there for a moment. Let's grab our little buddy. And, let's move this, this, mm-hmm. Didn't get any fat with that. These, which I'm not sure what we do with yet. Pear tree cuttings can be planted or grafted. 25% survival chance. Not good. I found this, some bismuth. I also found a huge deposit of tin. Nice. Which means that we can... Uh, Get on with um, making bronze instead of just having to rely on. There we go. Now, time is well, that's going to be a bit early, but. Better than waiting the whole night, isn't it? Yeah, I always keep a, a dozen or so dry grass on you, so if you get stuck for the night, you can make yourself a quick seven hour bed. There we are. Welcome to daytime. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, I wasn't kidding. It's, uh, and there was a rift right there by that redwood tree. Is that copper? I don't know what it is. We'll take that. <laughs> okay. So, did I find bees? No, I did not. Um, sadly enough. I did do a fair bit of exploring, and the other side of this huge mountain I'm standing beside I said, has a huge, and it's, it was exposed, I saw it walking by, a huge tin deposit. But yeah, it's way around the, this is a huge mountain, and it's all the way around the other side. However, now I've got the background sounds turned way up. I have the music turned off for the moment. Um, I like having the music on. It's one of the few games we can actually have the music on. Um, but, yeah, I don't want to uh, distract from the sound of bees. Problem is, it's all bloody redwood. I mean, there's the occasional little uh, birch and stuff, maple. But it's birch and maple forests where the bees tend to be. There's another rift. My god. That's horrible. Just horrible. Don't you think, Mr. Cow? Yeah, I do. So yeah, the hunt for bees. Not successful so far. <laughs> I snuck up on a rooster. Dopey chicken. Oh, I see more copper. Oh, quite a deposit. Okay, we'll have to mark this one. Because that's a little better than the usual uh, bits and bots. So, let's get our little pattern out here. This way I know where I actually found it, in case the map marker is slightly off. Which they can be, because these are fairly big 
chunks it's showing us. Boom. And copper. Now, of course, with the uh, nice tin find, we are immediately going to be moving to bronze as opposed to uh, copper from here out. We will indeed. Oh, I did use pretty much all of my path dirt, didn't I? Hmm. What are you? Oh, you're just a little cow, okay. Pigs? Yeah, right on. Oh, more copper. Small deposit. We can deal with that other one instead. Hey, raccoon. <laughs> I just love all the animals in this game. It's great. There's a wabbit. I think I'm gonna grab him. Rats. There he is. Come on, rabbit. No. Hmm. Oh well. Let's uh, continue on. Where am I, by the way? <laughs> so, our home is. Somewhere? Anywhere? Anyone? Hello? Ah, way down here. So we are considerably north and we're actually heading kind of the wrong way here. Oops. So... What did we find? Turnips! Hey! Of course all of our spears are in the wrong place. There we go. Nice. Right on. A little bit of food, a little bit of seeds. Nice. Just nice. Alright. Oh, we need to eat. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Alright. Let's wash that down with a little bit of bowl of rotten food. Uh oh. Hmm. Well. We've got some berries. Let's finish these. You can see they're not giving us that much. Excellent. All right, so two bowls of rotten food. Ew. All right, do we see any croppage at least? There's something over here. We got a little bit of grain going on. It's just rye, but hey. We have so little in crops But I am not going to be fussy about what we do or don't take, believe me. Oh, I don't need to eat those yet. Don't do it, dude. Oh, what did we find here? One piece of copper. I'll grab the flint as well. Seeing as we are still using flint. 
A little bit more copper. Oh, quite a bit more copper. Okay. So. There we go. And. Where are we? We're way up here. We're still going the wrong way. <laughs> But I get easily distracted, unfortunately. Well, I suppose we could eat berries. I was just going to say, we don't have the food to stay out another day. And it's already 11 in the morning. So. <laughs> you silly rabbits. Reach my long arm down that hole. No. Oh, hey, look what I see. Not that, but this. Crimson King. Oh, that's one of those red maples. Interesting. Okay. There's another rift right in front of us, eh? Lovely. Well, we don't want any part of that. I tried attacking one, eh? Guess what? It's not a good idea. No. They just sort of attack you right back, you know what I mean? What is that? Is that a beehive? What is that? Huh. Or maybe it's just a birch hollow. too. One birch hollow. Huh. Interesting. ones don't have room so uh anything else so oh, we can get rid of our little bit of copper there we go nice and yeah i'm gonna guess that's about it eh okay no we don't want anything to do with our oh look at this right away eh? nice. I did just finish 
<laughs> putting these away. Uh, it's all right. Oh, carrots. Huh? I'm actually going to pass on them for the moment. I don't have the space. We do still need an empty hand. <laughs> Come on, bees. This is actually the most bee-like area I've been in so far. But it's still not quite right. Well, a lot of these, I don't think they're actually edible though. They might be. Hello, piggies. Hello, goats. Oh, don't worry, I don't care about your little dudes. More carrots. So where are we map-wise now? Well, we're heading in the right direction anyway. Oops, I keep using the wrong uh, button to slide the map. In fact, we're heading in exactly the right direction, south. Yes, indeed. All else fails, head south. Death cap. Well, now there's a mushroom I'm going to be anxious to pick up. I've got quite a lot of quartz. Yeah, see, we're getting into an, almost an exclusively redwood forest again. And we're getting back to conglomerate stone, so we know we're getting close to my area. Like I say, there's the occasional little birch once in a blue moon a maple but for the most part redwood forests don't seem to be very bee friendly environs bits we've actually got a fair bit of that as well what the heck is that brown coal that's weird why would it be like that hmm that is really weird Okay, let's get rid of this. 
huddly area. Yeah, I could say there's the occasional maple. But not much. What's that? Pink bonnet mushrooms. Hmm. Shush. Whoa. Ooh, what do we got here? More brown coal. Eh? Alright, I thought I had a wolf after me, but I guess he decided against it. That's quite the... Uh, Quite the wee cave. I'll take some flint. I also hear a drifter. Hmm. Well, he's no finding what we need. Yeah. All right. Well, we made it home at least fairly safe and sound. So, let's dump off. Our metal bits. There we go. Oh, I'll have to empty my, uh, whatchamacallit, there's a piece of brown coal. And I think that's about all you're gonna get until I open my bag. So, let's do that. That's not good. It's not good. Better replace these. Good. Okay. Now. Alright, we get this. This, and this, and this. There we go. That should do it for rock stuff. Okay. We actually got a different, uh, a couple of different uh, tins here. Why have I got three of these? Clear quartz, quartz chunks, oh, borax, and alum. Okay, so they're completely different beasties. And one piece of iron meteorite. Um, hmm. You've got that stuff. How about... 
Um, if we do this. Hammer. Thank you. All right, let's grab you back out again. Boom. Wow, 410, <laughs> actually 403, wow, okay, well that did help break it down a bit, I'll give her that, uh, it still didn't give me the room I needed, <laughs> why did I think that would work? All right, what do I not? Actually, let's take these out. And let's take this guy. Let's beat on him. Oh, yeah, 35 bismuth. Bismuth. Don't know what to do with that yet. Yet. Are these both just poor? Oh, that's a medium. All right, this guy I'll break down. Boom. Poof. Okay. Now we have room for all of our minerals. Excellent. Let's get this in here. Nice. All right, I think that's going to do it. For this particular room, no, let's uh, okay. Now we have a lot of harvesting to do, <laughs> which is great, and that will be the focus, I think, next episode. Tried to get some bees, tried to do a little exploring, but. Yeah, it's not, uh, not paying off. All right, what do we got here? Did I just hear a dude? Like in here? No, apparently not inside, so I don't care. All right, let's go back to here. What else have we got? We've got one piece of raw red meat. Um, fat, no. No more berries. Oh, we've got these cranberries. Boom. That gives us a stack of cranberries. Nice. Now, this one should have these guys. Boom. And spelt grain, blah, blah. What else have we got here? We've got some rice grain. Okay. Let's get these. Actually, no. That's going to stay a materials locker. Let's... Grazer poop. Oh, okay. Apparently we're at our limits with that. That's okay. I think what I'm going to do is actually grab this back. And this, and this. All right. Now I should be able to put these in here. And, okay, the other ones are in my tub. But we're gonna take this guy and put him there. Nice. <laughs> This is going to be our poop bucket. 
Everybody's got to have a poop bucket. And we'll put our little bit of rot in there as well. Okay. And speaking of a little bit of rot, in case you don't know, this is how you clean your dishes if you get uh, uck in them, i.e. rot. And we've got one more tree hollow. That's cool. Whoop. There we go. Yeah, you need water. Um, that's not going to do. You actually want your water to be... There it is. Chuck it in there. Oh, I'm too close, apparently. No, we got to give it a minute. Ooh, I'm going to step back in here. Give myself a torch. And you'll see the rot is now cleared out of the bowls. And you get it as a separate entity, which you can use to make composts. So, and we also have two bowls that are now apparently full of water. <laughs> Okay, I've never had that actually happen before. Interesting. But there we are. We have some more rot. Nine liters of rot. And two bowls full of water. Um, hmm. Well, this bucket's empty, isn't it? There we go. Now our bowls are empty. Boink. Boink good stuff. Okay. Hmm. Let's do this old dog. There we go. And I think what we're going to do is call it there. So I do hope everybody enjoyed. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Any uh, suggestions or hints, especially if it's how to find bees. <laughs> because that's going to be our real kind of sticking point for us for the moment is not having bees. And it's not particularly a sticking point I like. Yeah. Not particularly. So, what else have we got? We've got a fair bit of seeds, eh? Turn up uh, that, what are you, spelt. I thought one of these was spelt. There we go. Okay. And those. We'll have to figure out what to do with these, because I think I've got some from another type of tree as well. So, yeah. But... As I say, I'm going to end it here. So I do hope everybody enjoyed. Quartz chunks, borax. Hmm. So I've got this in a couple of different places. Yeah, there's the other one. I've got a pink apple tree. And now we've got a pear tree to go with it. Interesting. All right, folks. Take care of each other. And ciao for now.